Matchmasters, it's bad. I have made an awful discovery. So recently, Maxi Hu and I made a great guide on Monkey Juju. The video is linked right here, by the way. And in celebration, I whipped out my dancing shoes and boogied. Only <laughs> to trip and fall. And get laughed at. That was the worst part. Worse than the tripping and falling part. Because that part actually hurt. No, but this part hurt more, like, emotionally. I just realized I can't dance. Wait, did? You can't dance? I hate to admit it, but yeah, there is something I can't do. Well, good for you. I'm a great dancer. <gasps> How are you doing that? My secret weapon, of course. Brocco Boogie. Oh my gosh, Max. You are so right. The answer was in my boosters all along. To master the art of dancing, I just need to master Brocco Boogie. This should be a piece of ca- Broccoli. Welcome to Brocco Boogie 101. We're boogieing through his best folks, pro level tips and tricks, what not to do, and uh... I feel like I'm missing something. I know, I know, you always forget this one. Tits. Game modes he shines in. Oh yeah, right. Brocco Boogie is the chillest booster to use. He is not phased by anything. You can tell by his unbothered dance moves. He uses the power of boogieing to stun his opponents and take them out. For a good time, I guess. Brocco Boogie throws out three disco balls initially, and you can use these on anything around it. What it will do is get rid of every color when it's used on that chosen shape. This is great to remove so many colors to help you get your blues for constant disco balls. If you use Brocco Boogie again in the same round, you'll get two disco balls instead of three. Bugs! Teleporter. For Brocco Boogie, I use this to get more blues if I need it, or make some fours. Mini Cleo. Amazing perk to help you get your blues in the beginning for Brocco Boogie. You can also duplicate specials to clear the board. Tips! Disco balls do wonders for getting rid of your opponent's reds. It will get rid of all the reds on the board and make it super hard for them to get their booster. You could also use the disco balls with specials on the board to activate the specials. Also, something so important, when you use your disco ball on a color, if that color also has specials on the board, it will all activate. It's insane. So if you have a color that has maybe like a few more specials than other colors, it might be worth just activating that. You've got to be calculated. Brocco Boogie is great for manipulating the board, dropping certain colors to help grab your blues. You want to keep the board dancing, so constantly pushing for your booster is so important. Disco balls also don't take a turn to use, so you can use them to your heart's content. What not to do? Do not use your disco balls on the blues. This will eat all your blues and not give you anything for your booster. Disco balls cannot be duplicated by mini clears. As cool as it would be, it's just too powerful. Brocco Boogie does great in game modes where certain pieces are worth more. So for example, if greens are worth 5, using the disco ball on the green pieces will grab you so many points. Modes that drop specials. Brocco Boogie can activate these for free with his disco balls if they're close by. Brocco also does great in 1v1s, making opponents jealous of his wow. killer dance moves. Okay Max, you need to show me how to dance. I've got you. Wow! That was me doing a dance move. No. <laughs> I want to try something crazy. What? You want to try something different? Usually I would use the perks that I recommended at the start of this video, but I kind of want to try Mini Cobra. You know what? Go for it. It's really important when you are like playing with these boosters, you want to test out different perks to see what's different. Mini Cobra is not one that I see often with our videos. Yeah, that's so... why I kind of wanted to play it because it was just like, I don't see people use it very often and I just want to find a, a way to make it work and make it super good. Oh, that was good. Pop off. Yeah. That was good. So what's the rules for this game mode? Uh, so the beans are blues and reds. Blues and reds. That is perfect for Brocco Boogie because you can easily get your booster this way, no? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to see three disco balls. Oh, you're going to make everything fall down together. Like, oh, okay, I see you. Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to try and make things drop together so I can use them to, like, get different things. If they drop into fours, that's perfect. We'd love to see it. <gasps> Pop all of those at the bottom. Okay, that was a good round. Yeah, you had a booster up for the next thought, round as well. I thought that was, yeah, that was a pretty good turn. <laughs> I feel like Brocco Boogie can sometimes be hard to do things compared to like other people who clear the board, but like when you actually get it to work, it's so good. I would say Brocco Boogie is very rewarding when you master him. When yes, you master him, definitely. he's insanely strong. He can do so much. It's, it's a lot of calculating. Look at his dance moves. It's the best thing ever. <laughs> Also, you've got to pick him just to see that every time, <gasps> It's next to the reds. Are you going to do it? Are you going to do it to him? Uh, oh, you can't get that four. I'm going to try and 
clear everything else. So towards the end of our turn is when I would use the reds. That is genius. Yeah. <gasps> There's a four. Am I? I missed a four. I just saw it, but somehow it worked out. It's fine. <laughs> I meant to do that. That was all part of my oh, plan. Oh, Cobra! <gasps> that was my plan. Because I feel like it's such a good way to just get fours, get your booster, mm -hmm. just keep doing different things. Ooh, make it okay. work. <gasps> I have no time, but Oh, and you fine. just got your booster! Okay, let's yeah! go! Okay, this is great. This is great. We're doing it! You are doing it. That's yeah! crazy. This is such a good game for Broccoli Boogie because you just get like more different colors and stuff in this. Like to build your booster up for Broccoli Boogie is really important. Oh, look at this guy's dance moves. Oh, uh, he's trying to compete he's with He's trying the to compete with the master Broccoli Boogie. This is a dance off right here. <laughs> What's that movie with the dancing? Uh, there's a lot of movies the, with dancing. The, no, 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 like the. I feel like there are so many there's movies a dance I could for just that name. Life. You know what's funny? I'm saying there's so many movies you could name. Can't name a single one, by the way. No. <laughs> <laughs> there was a five you're throwing. I was thinking about dances. <laughs> but that's what I really love about Rocco Boogie. You can just have such fun conversations while playing him as well because he's just such a good mood boosting booster. Like a mood booster. <gasps> a, mood a mood booster. booster. <laughs> Okay, the blues are dropping. <gasps> the blues are dropping. There's another four. We get that four too. Ooh, time's running out here, buddy. Yeah, I don't know what to do. I guess I just do that for my booster. Yeah, because now you have your booster for next turn, which is still really good. Sometimes it's fine to use like a round just to get your booster. Oh, look at this guy's dance. He's coming in again. He hasn't learned. <laughs> no, but like, no joke though, This that boost is also really cool. I just like how sometimes it just clears the entire board because everything just turns into that one color. It, it, it's insane. It's so cool. Like, look at him just do that. Hello? Amazing. I also like the little encouragement voices in the little animation. Like, <laughs> I really yeah, the love... background sheep dancers. Off topic, but I really love your outfit. <laughs> <laughs> the surfboard adds to it so much in the background. The surfboard is like, wow, chef's kiss. Oh, that's so cool. Got all the reds. Oh, so much reds at the top though. Trying to get your booster. Yeah. Okay, okay. we got the four. Oh, you made it hard for him to get his booster instead. Yeah. Because I saw that he only had three. So I was like, yep. if he gets the three on the left, then that's still not enough. Yeah, that's, also, that I just remembered move. that movie. Step up. <laughs> that's what I was referring to. Okay, that's a good move on you because now he can't, he literally just can't get his booster. Oh, he did he yeah. he did the same thing to you. But there's a four on top. Well, Hello. There's a four. <laughs> okay. Yeah. The the drop into the four that mm -hmm. was super nice. We let this in. And you drop some more in. Okay, okay, okay. You could probably get your booster. Um, yeah, I'll just get rid of his reds. You know, it's it's become a personal thing now. It is We're, like, becoming trying personal. To dance off, it is and becoming personal. And now I'm trying to make him not dance. <laughs> I've like tied his shoelaces together. Oh my god, that's the best way to say it. <laughs> You're tying his shoelaces. <laughs> <laughs> that is great. <laughs> okay. Four red here too. Okay. Stop him even more. Okay. He can get the red to the top corner. Mm -hmm. Maybe he doesn't know. He does know. He does. <gasps> There's a four. Too late. Too bad. Uh, nice! Broco Boogie is dancer. crazy! I really like Broco Boogie a lot. He's super fun. So I think um, I think I can dance. I mean, you can watch me dance. I feel like that's what we learned today. <laughs> what? Okay. You now you're just being mean. I saw your dance at the start of this. Thanks for watching. Bye! <laughs> Bye. <laughs>